let's enter into our praise and worship time this morning. I'm so thankful for our Lord. I appreciate him and I love him. Let's sing Heavenly Father. I work for me when I do that.
that strength comes and you're able to speak it out, Thank Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. And then the situation and the circumstances begin to change and the peace begins to settle in. Listen, he's here today, church. All you got to do is speak his name and call upon him. You want to go to him in prayer this morning? I know that he's already aware of everything that's going on in our lives, but he wants to hear from his children. Amen. Amen. I love my children, and I like to hear from them. Yes. You know, they never came around, and they didn't see them at any time. I'd think, well, what's wrong? Yes, 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 yes. So, like, like, like to hear from them. I know yeah. they know that I love them, and uh, I know they love me, but I just like to hear their voice once in a while. Yes. 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 I'd like to hear from you from time to time, too. Amen. Probably, Amen. probably more often than you, you, you think that he does. But we want to go to have a prayer, so if anyone has a prayer request, for, Thank you, Jesus. Jesus. for my dad, just for peace and comfort. For me, I feel really drained. I haven't been here. I want to thank him because the fair's over. He blessed it, but I'm so happy that it's over. Um, in these situations that I need guidance in. Anybody else is last month or so I've seen so many changes in our youth and our children I'm praying that God shows them the gift that he has given them in ministry and just bring them forward in strength in that in that avenue Speak 
thanks to the Lord that they would understand we continue to show mercy and grace, Lord. Give us the strength that we need to hold on to you no matter what comes. In Jesus' name, have your way throughout this service. Help us to focus on you today. This is your house and your time, Lord. We're here to honor and to lift you up. In Jesus' name we ask.
nuestra regala la santa aleluya aleluya oh we praise your holy name what a mighty God thank you Jesus
that surpasses all understanding, Lord. We thank you for your touch, Lord. Oh, we thank you for your touch, Lord. 
Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, we thank you and praise you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. Is that all right for the Holy Spirit to move Amen. before yes, the right. That's right. Amen. Amen. Is that all right for the Holy Spirit to move before we take the offering? Amen. Amen. <laughs> we got a schedule and we got a plan, but God can just mess it up. I all love it. Thank That's you, Lord. It. Yes. Bless the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Continue to worship the Lord. We are going to ask the ushers to come. We're going to worship our tithes and offerings. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Would you like to stand and read the annotations for me? 
Oh, well, praise the Lord, everybody. God is so good. Hallelujah. You know? It's an honor to be here. See the pastor there, you know? I mean, it's just wonderful to be in the presence of the Lord. The joy of the Lord is our strength. No matter how you feel, let the joy of the Lord be your strength. Yes. I was sitting here and I was thinking, I got my gift. Amen. So don't ever think to yourself, ain't nobody did nothing for me. Amen. Jesus did it for you. Amen. He paid the price. And it's a free gift. All you got to do is receive. Amen. Isn't that wonderful? I'm glad he didn't say you need a million dollars. I'd be left out preaching. But it's an honor to be in the house of the Lord. It's much of an honor to be saved and to know him personally. You know, not religion. I'm not talking religion. I'm talking about a relationship with Jesus Christ and knowing him personally. Because guess what? He's coming back again. And I intend to go with him. Hallelujah. I got the gift of eternal life because Jesus got it for me. Amen. He paid the price. I just received that gift. So I hope you all received it. If you didn't, say, Jesus, I want that gift. Hallelujah. You'll get eternal life. God bless you. speaking for <laughs> both of us. I'm not sure what you have to get to That's okay. I thank God for being here among all the saints. The Hallelujah. word of God yes. says how good and how pleasant it is yes. that we dwell together. It's like the oil, the ointment that's on the head and it flows down. And truly, I thank God for being here in this day and being alive, knowing him, having a personal relationship. I was sharing this morning with the sister um, out in the hall as service was ending here for this morning service. And I was remembering and thanking God even before I came into the sanctuary for being here because it was so long ago that they sat in front of me, the doctors, and told me I was dead. Mm -hmm. They declared me dead and I'm sitting up and I'm speaking to them and telling them I will not die yeah. but live yeah. according to the yeah. word of God. Yeah. And I will declare his glory and every day that he gives me I thank him for it. It's an opportunity yeah. to praise him yes. for what he's done. Yeah. I thank God for being here and being among all of you smiling faces and singing and dancing yeah. and, and praying. Oh I just praise God for it. Y'all be blessed and stay in the Lord. Amen. Amen.
shadow you will light up, mountain you will climb up, coming after me. Yes, Snow wall you won't kick down, lie you won't tear down, coming after me. Snow wall you will light up, mountain you will climb up.
Joshua and the elders passed on. It's one of the scariest verses in the Bible to me. It says that there arose a generation after them that didn't know the miracles and the blessings of God and the things that God had performed. That's right. One generation is all it took for it to end. That's right. And they began heading down that path of trouble, yeah. following after false gods and yeah, lies yeah. and everything yeah. else. Yeah. If we don't instill it in our kids and our grandkids now, yeah. if they grow up knowing what it means to come into a church service and experience the move of the Holy Ghost, yeah. 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 then they're not going to know. They're not going to understand. They're not going to have what it takes. The enemy would try to keep us busy trying to earn it. Right. <clears throat> trying to feel that we are good enough or we've gotten things in our life straightened out to the point that now I can serve God. Right. Listen, let me tell you why he does that. Because he knows that you will spend the rest of your life right. spinning right. those wheels yeah. and getting nowhere. That's right. That's right. Amen. That's right. Amen. How many of us, maybe some are doing it now. Mm. How many times have we tried to fix things? Right. Come on. Right. Come on. Yep. Well, this time I'll do better. Mm. <laughs> this time will be different. Mm -hmm. Right. Come on. Then. But we're doing it the same way in our own strength and our own ability. Yep. That's giving it to God and letting right. God have His way. Right. That's right. And right. the results are going to wind up being the same again yeah, right. and again right. and again. Right. 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 Amen. 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 Right, brother. But when we finally get to the place and we humble ourselves, and the word says he will not turn away a humble or a contrite spirit. Mm -hmm. I think we talked yeah. about this Wednesday night in Bible study. That word contrite, the translation means to literally be crushed to dust. Right. Yeah. Yeah. When we get to the place that our spirit has literally been broken to the point, mm -hmm. why do we go through some of the things? Because you know what? You need to be broken. Yes. 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 Amen. Yes. Amen. Yes. He's the potter, we're the yes. clay. Yes. Yes. He makes the vessel that he Amen. wants yes. to make. Amen. 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 Even when it means breaking down that clay and breaking down that vessel, oh, he's the only one that has the ability, the master potter, to Amen. piece it back together. Thank you, Lord. Make a vessel that we didn't even realize was there. Amen. 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 Yeah, I thought I was going to be a bowl. Look at me in this picture now. Yeah. There you go. God had other plans. Amen. Amen. When we humble before him and say, Lord, I'm done trying. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Right. I give up. That's it. Yes. Yeah. I can't do this. That's right. I give myself to you and I'll let you. Yes. 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 Then and only then. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Lord. Thank Thank you. Lord. Thank Lord. Lord. Thank Amen. Lord. Amen. That's right. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Praise Thank God. You, Lord. Praise Amen. Lord. That's right. Well, that's yes. not the sermon that you gave to me this morning. That's a good word. You've been here any amount of time, no doubt you've heard this before, but be like Peter. 
Even though you already know these things, and I feel it necessary to remind you of them. Kids, if you're going to go to Children's Church, you can go and be dismissed. <laughs> Those that are going. A couple of things that I want to talk about this morning. I'm going to be in 2 Peter, if you want to go ahead and turn there. We'll start in uh, chapter 3. 2 Peter chapter 3. <clears throat> Something that's coming up quite a bit in just different discussions and Bible study and different things. This repentance is the first thing I want to talk about. Amen. See, without repentance, there cannot be salvation. That's right. Amen. Amen. If we don't repent of our sin, what must I do to be saved? Repent and believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Yes, yes, yes. Too many are trying to do away with that one part of it, and it's simply believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. You can believe on Him or in Him or however you want to call it. But if we don't let Him make a change, and that change is what repentance is, we change our mind, our thoughts. Concerning sin. Right, That's right. Amen. Amen. To believe in Jesus or to know who he is and to not have a change doesn't do anything. That's right. right. Amen. That's right. Blessing Lord. Those that tell me that all it takes is a belief in Jesus Christ, and I said, Well then you're gonna share heaven with Satan? Mm -hmm. Come on. Come on. Come on. Say, Come on that. say that, preacher. Right. Right. Mm -hmm. Say it. Come on. What are you talking about? Right. He believes in Jesus more than you and I do. Right. That's right. That's right. right. Amen. Come on. Right. He's so. been in his presence. He knows him. Yeah. Right. Amen. Mm -hmm. He doesn't save you. That's no. right. Amen. Come on. That's right. Come on. Yes. No. Amen. But when we believe unto the point of repentance, yes, I understand and see that I need to think differently concerning the life that I'm living. Amen. 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 Does that mean that it's easy that we can just shut off this valve and right. no that's something they don't else they don't preach about much anymore this is this thing that they used to call sanctification that's right yeah. Yeah. Come on. it's a process yeah, that's right that's right. right it's a never ending process yeah, amen amen thank you yeah. but it's a process that you got to start it just yeah. doesn't right. happen that's yeah. amen Sanctification being set apart specifically for God's use. Yes. Separating ourselves from the world and the world's use of our lives. You don't own me anymore, world. Yeah. Amen. 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 You don't dictate what I do and where I go and how I live. I now belong to God. He Amen. says who I am and what I do and how Amen. I'm to be used. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Sanctification, a process, repentance, changing our mind. 2 Peter chapter 3, verse 9 says this, The Lord is not slack concerning His promise, <laughs> as some men count slackness, but is long-suffering to usward. Amen. Get the question all the time. If yeah. God is God, if He's real, then why is all of these things still allowed to go on in the world? Why is all the suffering and the hardships and the... the Turmoil, all that we see. Why, well, why doesn't he put a stop to that? Right. Well, at what point in your sin did you want him to step in and put a stop to you? All right. All right. All right. All right. Say that Say stop. That's right. right. Amen. Listen, this is the explanation, and it's, it's the best one I can give you because it's it's biblical. Amen. Why does he allow this to happen? Because he's patient. Yes. 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 The Bible says that he's long suffering to usward. Why? Not willing that any should perish. Right. The minute that he steps in and says, That's it, enough's enough, and it's coming. Yes. Right. Amen. Amen. Right. But the minute that that happens, somebody is going to get left out. Right. That's right. Amen. Amen. That's it. Thank God it wasn't the day before I got saved. Amen. 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 Thank you. Amen. Right. Yeah, I wanted to come in and put an end to all of this and all the sin, but don't do it the day before I get saved. Mm -hmm. Come on. Thank you, Jesus. Think about it. Praise Amen. God. Praise God. But he's long suffering to us, we're not willing that any should perish. But, and, and this caught my attention. 
but that all should come to repentance. Amen. Thought that kind of odd. You ever read that? Probably a thousand times. Mm. Long suffering to us, not willing that any should perish, but that we should get saved? Mm. He doesn't say that. Right. Come on, brothers. That we should come to <coughs> repentance. Repentance. How many people have come to, and I know this is hard for some to understand, and I'm telling you right now, if you're one of those that you believe in the doctrine of once saved, always saved, we don't teach that here. That's right, amen. amen. It's dangerous. That's right. As I heard one preacher say before, that may be a good doctrine to live by, but I don't want to die by it. Amen. Right. Amen. Right. Come on. That's right. How many people, and we know this, have come to a place, an altar, or wherever it is, that they got down before the Lord and they asked Him to forgive Him, and they got saved. Some of them didn't get out the church doors before the devil stole that from them. Right. That's right. That's yeah. right. That's it. True. Yep. <clears throat> Or as soon as they get out there after a Sunday service and Monday hits, come on. Yep, that's true. We're back in the world and the world's beating on us and the temptations and right. the life and everything is there and we get right back into that. Listen, right. there's some things that are, are absolutes. The world doesn't want to teach you absolutes anymore. Right. But there are some things that are absolutely yeah. correct. Right. Right. Absolutely. Amen. Amen. Right. Amen. Yep. God's Word is one of them. Yes. Yes. One of those yeah. things yeah. that will not change. It hasn't right. changed from right. the beginning. Right. Right. From the moment in the garden, from the moment that Satan was cast out of heaven. Mm -hmm. Amen. Sin will separate you from God. Amen. 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 Yes. 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 Well, being in a relationship with God, well, that, that covers it. We're, we're under grace. So, tell that to Satan. Right. Come on. Tell that to Adam and Eve. Mm -hmm. Come on now. All right. Even though we enter into a relationship with the Lord, we've, we've been saved. If we return to sin and we continue in sin, God cannot be a liar. Sin will separate you from Him. Right. No yes. sin yes. is going to enter into heaven. Yeah. Amen. Amen. Yeah. Have your yep. way. I can already hear the arguments. Well, the, the, how does grace work? I make a mistake. Isn't that what grace is for? Yes, that is what grace is for. For when right. you make a mistake. Right. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Not when you willingly go right. back into Come sin. Come on, say that, preacher. Amen. 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 When you willingly return to the same old life and you don't allow God to change you, the Bible says, we're as a dog returning to his vomit. Amen. That's yes. right. Yes. That's the word. That's right, brother. That's the word. The word also says at that point that it's better to never to have known. Come on. Right. That's right. Then to have known the mercies and the goodness of God yeah. and then to turn away from it. Amen. Well, if I never knew, I'm going to hell. If I never know the Lord, come on. That's it, right. Amen. If I never get saved, then I'm not going to heaven. I'm going to hell. That's it. Well, it's better for me never to have known. <clears throat> well, if I never knew, I was going to hell. Be better then to do that than to know and walk away. Yep. Mm, something yes. here. That's right, brother. Good, Something's not making sense here. It must not be okay to just go and live any way I want to, that's even right. though I knelt in an altar. Right. Yeah. Come on. That's right. See, that's where repentance comes in. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Because once I have knelt at that altar, I recognize the fact that I am a sinner and I need a Savior. Mm. And here in His Word, God is long-suffering. Not just that somebody would get saved, but they would come to repentance. Yes. Amen. Not just to come to the place to say, I, I, I'm sorry for what I've done. Right. Lord, See, that's not repentance either. No. Mm -hmm. Say, yes, I need a Savior, and I repent. That means I change my mind concerning the sin. Amen. I no longer want to live that way. I no longer to des desire to be that person and to live that lifestyle. Right. I, yeah. I repent. That's what God wants to bring. He's long-suffering that we would come to repentance. Right. The ability for our lives to change. Amen. 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 Not just for a moment, but for good. Yes. 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 Yes
Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Hallelujah. Well, why are you harping on that, Pastor? Because without it, you cannot truly be yes. saved. Amen. 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 Amen, brother. Preach. Yes. Lord. Repentance is not doing penance. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's right. That means paying a debt right. for what you owe. Mm. Okay, I've lived a, this life and I've done all these things, so now I owe God. I'm going to do penance. I'm going to do good works. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. I'm going to work in the church. And I'm going to go and uh, help the needy and give money to the poor. And through your actions, yeah. you're justifying mm -hmm. your goodness, yeah. your worth of being saved. Right. Penance. Mm -hmm. That's not repentance. Exactly. We don't Amen. buy our way into heaven. Right. We don't become good enough to get into heaven. Right. Right. We don't Amen. earn our way into heaven. Amen. That's right. Yes. Amen, brother. Yes. Thank you. already mentioned earlier, it's a free gift. Thank God I accepted right. that gift. Yes. yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. You don't have to do anything to be saved. You have to accept the gift. Amen. 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 That's Amen. Right. That's Thank it. you, Lord. And then we have to repent. Yes, yes. sir. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. Change our mind concerning the sin. Yes, yes. right. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Verse 10, he goes on to tell us the seriousness of this. But the day of the Lord will come as a thief in the night, in the which the heavens shall pass away with a great noise. And the elements shall melt with fervent heat. The earth also and the works that are therein shall be burned up. You've heard me mm -hmm. say it before. Look around. Everything that you see right. is going to be gone. Yeah. Yeah. That's, yeah. It. That's true. Anything that's in this world, whether it be good, whether it be bad, whether it be ugly, whether it be beautiful, it's not going to last. No, it's man. no, no man. sir. No, sir. It's you. going to be burned up with a fervent heat. This whole yes. earth is going to pass away. Yes. There's going to be a, a new heaven and a new earth. Yeah. 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 Seeing then that all these things shall be dissolved. Mm. What if I told you this time tomorrow, mm. all of this is going to be gone. The right. fire like you ain't never seen before is yeah. going to burn up the entire world. Oh, Jesus. This time tomorrow, it's all history, gone. Yep, that's true. Well, then what manner of person ought you to be? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, my mom. In all holy, that's not mm -hmm. WHO, not completely, holy mm -hmm. conversation that you're living, your lifestyle. In all holy living mm -hmm. and godliness. Yes, if I really believe, and God's word says it, so I believe it, that this is what's going to happen. That one of these days, it's all going to come to an end. Yes. It's yes. all going to burn up and be yes. dissolved. And what kind of person should I be? Right. Yes. That's right. Yes. Amen, brother. Right. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Looking for and hasting unto the coming of the day of God, wherein the heavens being on fire shall be dissolved, and the elements shall melt with fervent heat. Nevertheless, we, according to his promise, look for new heavens and a new earth, wherein dwelleth righteousness. Yes, Praise God. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Wherefore, beloved, seeing that ye look for such things, be diligent. That ye may be found of him in peace without spot and blameless. Thank you, Lord. He's coming Jesus. looking for a clean church. Yes. Thank Thank you, Come Lord. on. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. In account that the long suffering of our Lord is salvation. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. Yeah. Even as our beloved Paul, also according to the wisdom given unto him, hath written unto you, is also in all his epistles, speaking. In them of thing, these things, in which are some things hard to be understood, which they that are unlearned and unstable rest, they wrestle with it. Yeah. As they do also with other scriptures unto their own destruction. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Man. I'll be the first one to stand before you and tell you I don't understand it all. That's it. Right. That's it. Okay. And the one that tells you that they do is either full of themselves or a liar. Amen. Right. Amen. 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 Yes. Amen. I yes. see now in part. Yes. As though looking through a glass darkly. Yes. Yes. Come on. 
Because his flesh is still in the way. Yes. Yes. That's it. Right. That's it. But one of these days when I oh, see him. Yes. Thank yes. you, yes. Hallelujah. Glory. Hallelujah. Then I'll know him full because I'll see him as he is. Yes, Lord. His flesh will be departed. It won't hinder me anymore. Yes. His spirit will be loose. Yes, yes. Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Lord. Thank you. That's good preaching. Hallelujah. That's good preaching. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Ye therefore, beloved, seeing you know these things before, beware lest ye also, being led away with the error of the wicked, fall from your own steadfastness. Mm. Boy, if that don't go against one saved, always saved, I don't know what does. Mm. Okay. To be steadfast and then fall away from it? Hmm. Lord, have mercy. Well, that ain't what I came to preach. Lord, have mercy. Have your way, Lord. I want us to focus on the last verse of this chapter, 18. Thank you, Father. There is a process, as I said, sanctification there's a growth of the believer that has to take place. Amen. Yes. yes. We Amen. have our discipleship study. This is one of the things that we talk about. Once we come to the Lord, we are babes in Christ. I don't care if that happens when you're 10 years old or 100 years old. Mm. When we come to Him new, we're children. Yes. Babies. To be exact, right, when it first right. come. Yes, yes, yes. And there's a growth process that has to take place that parallels what we understand in the natural. Right. Amen. If we have a baby and that baby never grows. Something's wrong. Something's wrong. <laughs> and we have no problem identifying. Hey, that kid's 10 years old and it's still this long and in diapers. Late. What's, what's going on? Yes. yes. That ain't right. No. Right. Amen. Yet with Christians, oh, be patient. The Lord is being patient with me. You be patient with me too. Yes, we need to have patience yep. with one another. We're also to forbear one another. That means put up with all of our issues. Yep, that's true. That's true. Yeah, you got them too. Oh, yeah. 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 Amen. Come on, bro. Look at me. It's the truth. <laughs> <laughs> Praise the Lord. But that growth has to continue to take place. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. And this is where it gets difficult spiritually, but it's, it's, it's somewhat also parallels physical that we see. Right. Not all kids grow at the same rate. That's right. Amen. That's right. That's right. Amen. Right. Amen. 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 Spiritually speaking, not all Christians grow at the same rate. That's right. Amen. 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 Some seem to get in there and get a hold of it and dig in, and it all seems to come easy, and they seem to have that understanding. And th this is always a difficult thing, is, especially when a couple comes in, a husband and a wife, new to the Lord, and, and one or the other seems to get in there and just take off. Yeah. yeah. And the other one, not so fast. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the one that's taken off <laughs> starts to lose some patience. What's the matter with them? Mm -hmm. True. How come they're not getting after it the way that I'm getting after it? How come right. they're not feeling what I'm feeling? Right. How come they're not desiring to do what I'm desiring to do? Right. Mm -hmm. right. Well, because we're children. Right. We started off as babes, and we have different growth rates, and yes. we have to understand yes. that. That's right. right. Yes. That's so right. true. Yes. So true. But the reality is that there must be growth. Yes. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. Absolutely. Amen. Amen. If you've been serving God for any kind of time at all, a week, a month, a year, unfortunately some could say years, and they're absolutely the same today as right. the day they got up on the altar of salvation. Uh -huh. yeah. Something is wrong. Yeah. Amen. Yes. That's right. Yes. That's right. Yes. 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 God did not intend for it to be that way. That's not Amen. natural. Amen. Amen. Physically or spiritually. Amen. Paul, when he went back to check on one of the churches, he, he got unto them. He's like, hey, I, I know what I poured into you and the time that I spent here and I taught you and, and I heard some things. But I, had, I came back to check and, and it's true. Mm -hmm. After all this time, those of you that 
by now should be teachers and, and preachers and leading people and showing them the things. Yes. Yes. You're still yes. babies. Right. Yes. Yes. Right. Yes. Right. You, you should be chewing on some meat and getting some nourishment, but you still have need of milk. Mm -hmm. Lord, have you still need somebody to show you what to be the basic principles of God. Right. This ain't right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Amen. Amen. Some of you may remember this. I know I've talked about this before, but guess what? We're going to do it again. Hmm. That's all right. Amen. <laughs> Verse 18 says, but to grow in grace. Yes. Listen, these are the last words that the Holy Spirit gives to Peter to write down to the church. Right. Amen. The very last words that he passes on, I think they're important. All of these things that we're to understand, and he finishes with this, but, but, in spite of all this, but, grow in grace. Amen. Grace at this point is to the believer. It is the power of God. Amen. 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 This grace that he's talking about is not the, the commonly understood, the unmerited favor of God. Mm -hmm. That's what we receive that we talk about that we don't earn, that we don't deserve. Right, it's right. the grace of God. Amen. Unmerited favor. I didn't do anything to earn it. That's but once we have that favor and we are a believer and we're a child of God, then that grace changes. Come on. Come on. Amen. All right. Yes. It's a Holy Ghost enabling yeah. power yes. for you. Yes. Hallelujah. Amen. Yes. 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 Amen. Amen. When Paul had the thorn in the flesh, and God told him, my grace is so sufficient. sufficient. Amen. Yes. Your unmerited favor is sufficient hmm. to help me get through this affliction that I, I've now asked you three times to right. take away. Right. Yes. Right. It's not what he was talking about. That's right. Mm -hmm. No, Paul, my grace, my power, my enabling yes. power, yes. my yes. ability yes. to overcome, yes. even in the face of adversity. Yes. Don't yes. ask me again, Paul, because my grace that I yes. give to you Hallelujah. is sufficient. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Grow in grace and in knowledge of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. This is what the believer is to do. Amen. Amen. Here are the phases of growing. And I'm going to use a man as the example. It could be a woman. Mm. Don't make a difference. Right. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. First off is the baby stage. Mm -hmm. Think of this as spiritual terms of Christians. We first come to the Lord, the baby stage. Mm. A baby thinks only of itself. Right. Oh, a Christian don't do that. <laughs> a baby Christian does. Right. No a mature Christian shouldn't. Hmm, right. which one am I? Yeah, they do. Babies, they think of only themselves. And if they're denied the things that they desire, they're gonna pitch a fit. Yep. That's <laughs> it. That's it. What do you mean we're not painting the walls the color I like? Mm -hmm. uh. <laughs> All right now. Wah, wah, wah. Right. Right. What do you mean we're not changing the time of the meeting to the time that's convenient to me? Right. Wah, uh -huh. wah, wah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Come on. Right. That's true. That's true. Hey, I've seen church splits over stuff like that. Yeah. Right. right. That's it's right. too hot. It's too cold. It's... Yep. Come on. Yeah. Come on now. Yeah. Yep. That's true. It's true. Babies. Right. If it doesn't go my way, I'm going to get upset, I'm going to get mad, I'm going to take my toy and I'm going home. Right. That's it. That's it. I'll true. show you. It's true. Mm -hmm. That is very true. Oh Jesus. my goodness, Lord. So true. <laughs> Should not be. It seeks its own. Its feelings are easily hurt. Mm -hmm. It's often jealous. Come right. on now. Yep, it's true. A baby lives to be served. A baby never mm -hmm. serves. Right, right. I love Ezra to death. He hasn't brought me lunch once yet. <laughs> <laughs> After all the bottles I've given that kid. <laughs> it's a baby. Yep, amen. Right. amen. Yep. That's what babies do. Yep. Right? It's right. Yep. That's what baby Christians do too. Yeah. Mm. It drinks milk, mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. It cannot eat strong meat. It cries but never sings. Mm -hmm. Oh my. Come on. Right. Amen. It tries to talk but never makes sense. Oh my. Right. <laughs> These baby characteristics, unfortunately, are prominent in the lives of too many church people. Right. It's the truth. Mm -hmm. And it has nothing to do with how long they've been serving God. Amen. 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 They've been born into the family of God, but they fail. They've never developed spiritually. Yep. It's true. On. Maybe they've been saved for years. They're still babies. Yes. Right. Next after that is the child stage or the toddler stage, mm -hmm. whatever you want to call it. Some Christians grow to be little children spiritually. They've gotten saved. Maybe they've gotten past the point of being babies. But now they're just Christian toddlers. Mm. Little children, and they're satisfied with right. it. Mm -hmm. Come on. Now you get to interact a little bit, but it's still all about me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on. That's true. Oh, you can shake your head if you want to. That's all right. Oh, preach, preach it. <laughs> <laughs> they grow up to be little children spiritually, but they stop here. Mm. Here's some characteristics of children they are often untruthful yep. think about it right Amen. Amen. talking about christians here mm. their spiritual growth and where they're at mm. they're often untruthful they're envious mm. children are often cruel If rebuked, they become martyrs. <laughs> if crossed, they are resentful, and they often make a scene. You know full well everybody here is going through the whole right. church history, and right. people yep. are flashing in front of their eyes. Yep, yep, yep. 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 <laughs> Nobody here, of course. <laughs> Praise the Lord. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the hardest thing with anything that gets taught or preached. Mm. We all know somebody that, yep. boy, he's on them. Right. <laughs> the hardest part is to be truthful and honest with ourselves. Right. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Amen. Man, does any of that describe me? Amen. Right. Amen. Am I guilty? Thank mm. you, Lord. Thank you. Is that who I am? But I, I've been in church my whole life. I don't care. Mm, right. Right. Hear me. It has nothing to do with yes. anything. That's, That's, right. Right. That's, That's right. right. You could be in church your entire life and mm. still be a yep. baby spiritually. Right. right. Yeah. Or a spoiled toddler spiritually. Yes. Come yes. on. Yes. 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 They're often tail bearers, repeating everything that they hear. We call that gossip. Mm. They're given to emotional outbursts, mm. easily puffed up. They love praise and will accept it from any source. Right. Mm. <clears throat> they seek only the things that appeal to self. Got any spiritual children? Well, I'll get involved as long as it's something that I want. Right, come on. All right, now. I'll get involved and in the process it can make me look good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come on. Lord, I'll get involved if in the process it benefits me or my family. Come on. Right. right. Mm -hmm. It's true. It's true. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Spiritual children. That's right. Next stage would be that of a young man or a young woman. They've gotten past the babyhood, childhood, and beginning to mature in the Lord. This is what we want. 
spiritual growth of that of a young man or a young woman is not reached by many. Right. What a sad thing to right. say. Lord, have mercy. We're not even talking about someone who is a mature adult. Mm -hmm. To reach the stage of that of a young man or woman spiritually, Many Christians do not reach that stage. Either they never get past being spiritual babies, or they never get past being spiritual toddlers, or they don't stay in the church at all. Right, that's true. Yeah. That's true. Come on, that's not true. Wow. The young man or woman is strong, well able to overcome the enemy, has a vision for the future and the faith and the courage to tackle it. Yes. Yes. That's right. They don't need constant confirmation from everybody around them mm -hmm. to enable them. Right. Knowing who they are in God is enough. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Yep. Hallelujah. Knowing that God has called them and that God has enabled them that the anointing of God right. is upon them is right. enough to yes. spark in them the right. desire to move forward in the Amen. Amen. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Praise Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Yes. He is preparing for his productive years. <clears throat> Every one of us can become a young man or woman spiritually. Right. I believe it was Paul that said, made the statement, when I was a child, I did childish things, right? right. Yes. But I'm not a child anymore. Yes. Yes. That's right. And he understood this. He said, how, how do I now then go from being the child to the adult or the young adult? Yes. Put away childish well, things. Yes. 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 Amen. 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 That's right. Amen. The last one I want to talk about then would be the father stage. Spiritually mature. This stage of spiritual development can be reached by everyone. Amen. 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 God's intention is for every child of God to develop one day to the place of being a spiritual father or yes. mother. Yes. Thank you. Amen. Amen. How do the young ones learn? How do, are they taught? The men and the women are to go to them and to teach them and to show them. Well, how do we do that when we never get out of the adolescent stage of self? Right. Right. How do we show somebody else what it takes to serve God and how to live for God and how to be steadfast and yes. firm in our walk with God when we haven't figured it out yet? Right. Come on. Right. It's true. See, as much as we want to think about it, it it's not all about you. Amen. 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 Hey. Amen. Amen. Thank you. I know I'm going to repeat myself, but that's all right. Maybe it's because you need to hear it again. Right. All right. Okay. Amen. If salvation were the goal, Many of you can finish that sentence for me. Right. If it were the goal, the day you got saved, you'd take me out of here. Yeah. That's good, yeah. That's a, if that's what it was all about, right. and that's what, what God's entire plan for us was, was to get saved, mm -hmm. the minute it happened, rather than risk losing anybody, right? right? Mm -hmm. He'd take us yeah. home. Yes. 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 But that's not what that's it's all about. It's right. yeah. He right. chose men, human beings. He could have he could have sent down angels. Right. Mm. He could have chose all kinds of ways to, to do it. Mm -hmm. But for whatever reason, and I thank him that he did, he chose to use you and I. Right. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. To bring the gospel message Amen. to the Amen. lost. Amen. 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 That can't happen unless we mature That's right. in the Amen. Lord. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. We have to get past these baby stages, child stages, and even, even the young adults become spiritually mature adult fathers and mothers 
able to lead and to teach and to guide by example. Example. Yes. That's Amen. it. Amen. Yes. That's it. Yes. Amen. Not yes. just in yes. word. That's yes. it. Yes. Yes. Word example. is great when you have to use it. Right. Better than that is an example. Yep. Mm -hmm. Example. That is true. Yes, yes, yes. That is very true. That's it. The spiritual father has peace with God. Hallelujah. He knows the peace of God. He rejoices in his spiritual children. His patience with them. Amen. Amen. Patience with the younger ones that are coming up in the church. Mm. Yeah. That was us one time. Right. That's right. That's right. <laughs> spiritual mature man or woman has learned contentment mm -hmm. under all circumstances. That don't happen overnight. Right. No, no, no. That's true. Again, Paul, I have learned. It didn't just happen. That's right. I didn't get saved and then instantly, boom, there it was. Uh, no. I learned in all situations to right. be content. Yes. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Well, how do you learn that? Glad you asked. <laughs> it ain't yeah. fun. No, it's not. It ain't easy. It's, right. it's difficult. You gotta right. go through some stuff. That's right. right. Amen. You gotta experience some life. That's right. Amen. Oh, Pastor, you're just born serving God that way. You obviously uh -huh. haven't known me. Yep. Yeah, I, I gave my testimony. I was I was born in church. It's uh -huh. all I ever knew. I wasn't given an option. You're sick? Too bad. You're going to church. That's get right. Get healed. That's the way it was. That's the way it was. <laughs> yeah. It's the truth. There was never a time in my life that I wasn't in church. Mm. But there were plenty of times I didn't serve God. That's, That's right. right. That's true. Come on. So the fact that you're in church don't mean a hill of beans if you ain't serving God. Right. Amen. Amen. Yes. Amen. That's true. Amen. Right. So true. Well, I go to church. Well, what are you doing about it? You serving God? No, I'm still living for the world. Well, you're wasting your time. Right, that's right. That's right. Well, he's telling us not to come to church. No, you keep coming because maybe you'll get saved. Amen. Amen. Praise Amen. the Lord. Amen. That's it. <laughs> right. Amen. Praise right. the Lord. That's good. We learn to be content in all circumstances. What's going on in the world that's around right. me and in my life right now does not dictate whether I serve God or not, right. how well I serve God or not, right. whether I'm happy or not, whether I have peace or not, whether I have joy or not, come on, whether I still have power yeah, right. in God or not, yeah. it has nothing to do with those around me. It has nothing to do with the world. The world didn't give it to me. The world can't take it away. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And Satan, you can bark and growl and howl and, and all you want to and roar like a lion. You can seek to destroy me, but you can't do it because I got the joy of the Lord. I know who I am. I understand where I am. I know who my father is. I know where my strength comes from. I know where my heart comes from. Thank you, Lord. Some of you just you just look at him. You don't even have to talk to him. You having a bad day, ain't you? <laughs> <laughs> Your face is upside down. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Too many Christians we allow right. the things that we're exposed to day in and day out to dictate who we are in God. Yep. Lord, that's, that's, right. that's right. Lack of maturity. Mm -hmm. right. That's it. Right. I know that hurts. Yep. That's it. It's all that's right. It. true. Telling you the truth this morning. Tell the yes. truth. Tell the truth. Or put him on the ghost. He also knows the only source of true strength. <clears throat> Listen to this. He does not brood over the past. Amen. But looks to the future. Yes. How many of us have we allowed Satan to keep us right there? Right. Right. Right, Mom. That's true. Hey, you remember when? Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Remember when you did? Mm. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's true. You know who you used to be? Mm. Mm -hmm. Right, Mom. Right. 
You know what you missed out on? Yep. Oh, yeah. Come on. <laughs> Come on. That's true. What a lie that one is. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I'll tell you what I missed out on. Yeah. Most certainly I missed out on death. Right. Right. Most certainly I missed out on heartache. Most right. certainly I missed right. out on misery. Right. Come right. on. Right. 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 Amen. Most certainly I missed out on a lot of heartaches and headaches and every other kind of ache. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Right. Hallelujah, hallelujah. We don't dwell and, and brood over the past and what, what we thought life was going to be, but instead we look to the future. Yes. Mm. The spiritually mature also knows that all things work together <laughs> in his life for his eternal good. Amen, amen. amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I don't even know where to begin on that one. God has taught me that lesson. I don't stand here to try to brag in no way, shape, or form because it, it, it hasn't been easy right. to get to that place. But I, my wife is my witness. I do my best, and God has taught me to do this. And this is how we have true faith not to get down and worried over everything that mm -hmm. happens in life even when things look absolutely hopeless and like there's no way in the world they're going to turn around or any good can come out of it even in the midst of that I do my absolute best my mom taught me this Bless you, Lord. Lord, no matter what, I trust you. Yeah, amen. Amen. That's it. Amen. That's it. Amen. That's amen. It. That's Hallelujah. That's Thank you, it. Jesus. That's it. I know it doesn't look like it's possible or it's going to happen right now, but I trust amen. you. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. amen. That's it. That's, Thank you, Lord. That's it. That's Holy it, Pastor. God. My faith isn't in the experience or the emotions or the feelings or, mm -hmm. or the circumstances of what's right. happening around me. Right. It's not in what I feel. Right. That's right. That's good. But my faith is in you and who you are and what I yes. know. Yes. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Thank, you, Thank you, Lord. It's in the experiences that you've given me in the past yeah. that I draw on now. Yes. Amen. Yes. Yes. Lord, you've healed me before. You can yes. do it again. Amen. 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 God, you saved those that were lost that I love, and God, you'll do it again. Yes. Lord, when I didn't know where the finances were going to come from, where the provision was going to come from, yes. and it seemed hopeless and like I was going to lose everything. You yes. came through, Lord, in the nick of time. Come on, you'll do it again. Come on. Yes. Oh, but I pray for years. My children are still lost. Don't give up. Amen. Amen. Don't you dare stop praying yes. for them. Don't you dare give up hope. Yes. Amen. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Jesus. Thank, you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Mature Christian understands this. A babe doesn't even reach the place to understand the dangers or to worry about it. A, a toddler, or maybe even a, a young man or woman in Christ, they, they allow these things to overwhelm and overtake them. Right. Come on. We've got to get past that. We've got to grow in the Lord to a place of maturity. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Amen. Amen. These Amen. things that the enemy would continually choose to, to take me out of my walk. I've got to get to the place that I'm mature enough, that I recognize and I understand that they don't work anymore. Right. Hallelujah. That's, right. that's, right. that's it. Amen. That's it. That's oh, it. that's not possible. Yes, it is. Yes. Yes. I can tell you things in my life. Years ago, why I'd be contemplating some things. Oh, man, that sounds good. Now it's like, what are you even wasting your time for? That? That's it. Yep. I don't even think about that stuff. So, you know, you can try it once in a while. And I, and I, and I recognize, like, you're right. stupid. Yes, 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 yes. I ain't going there in years. I ain't going now. Right. Come on, Amen. 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 Yeah. I'll try. Right. That's right. Bless you, Lord. Hmm. The Thank spiritual you. mature knows that all things work together Amen. in his life for his right. eternal good. Right. You have to catch the wording of that. All things, even the ones that hurt, right. yeah. 
Even the ones that we don't understand. That's right. The ones that don't make sense. Yeah. Not for your feel good. Right. Come on now. Come mm. on. They work together for your eternal good. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Oh, yes. Hallelujah. That's where it's at. That's right. Oh, but this is uncomfortable now. I don't like this now. I'm not enjoying. I'm not having. All right. mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, if it keeps you out of hell and right. you get into heaven, you're going to be thankful. Yeah. Yes. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Last of all, he enjoys abundant life now mm -hmm. and will enjoy it in the life to come. Amen. Amen. That's right. Thank you, Lord. That's right. I don't live my life for the here and the now. I do what I do. I live the way that I live. I believe what I believe because of my hope in the future. That's Amen. Right. Amen. I'm setting my sights on eternal life. Yes. Amen. Amen. But that doesn't prevent me from being blessed right here. That's right. right. That's right. Amen. That's right. The Lord. You are and so am I. Highly yes. blessed. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, God. Amen. 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 His Amen. blessings are abundant unto me every morning that I wake up. Amen. Right. Every night that I lay my head on the yes. bed. Yes. Yes. Come on. Yes. Thank you, Lord. I've never gone hungry unless I chose to. Right. Amen. I've never been without anything that I needed. Right. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 I didn't say want. Yep. I've never been without anything that I needed. Right. Amen. God has always met me. He's Amen. always Amen. been there. Right. He's watched out for me. Amen. He's brought me to this point in time. Yep. He'll bring me all the way home. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Yes. I'm not living for now, but I know that there are blessings in the here and the now. And if they were to cease right now, which I know ain't going to happen. That's right. Mm -hmm. If they were to cease right now, I pray to God that I've matured enough to know what it's important and what it's all about, that it's not now, that it's what's to come, yes. and that I won't give up, that I'll hold on, Amen. holding out for that Amen. prize. Amen. 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 Stand with me, church. <laughs> I know that may have been a little lengthy to say what I That's all right. needed that's to all say. Amen. 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 Oh, Amen. That's all right. Amen. Amen. Jesus. Now comes the most critical part of the service. It wasn't everything else that took place up until now. It's right now. Amen. Amen. It's the most difficult thing that mankind has the ability to do is to be honest with yourself. Amen. Because it's always the other guy. Mm -hmm. Boy, he should. I was talking about somebody today, but mm -hmm. not me. <laughs> Be honest with yourself, church. Right. Amen. However long you've known the Lord, however long you've been saved, however long you've been in church, whatever you want to call it. Where have you gotten to? Is your life still the same as it was when you started? Does it look very similar? So I can tell you what, for a fact, from the time I started to now, my life has no resemblance whatsoever. Amen. We thank God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. No resemblance whatsoever of what it used to be. Thank you, Jesus. Have you gotten just enough of God or to a place of maturity level that you're satisfied? That's a problem, too. That's right. Amen. That's Amen. right. Well, I've gotten this good enough. Or I've gotten close enough to God that he's worked out some of these things here in my life. That's what happens to a lot of people. We get down in an altar and we cry out to God because we've gotten our life in such a mess and we know that 
as much as we tried, it's just getting worse. And we ask him to start to, to, to fix things and put it back together. And he does. And the instant that things, the pressure starts to ease off a little bit, we start heading right back to the same old oh, mm -hmm. Come on. And then we get mad at God. Well, why is he letting this happen? Well, what happened to you? Amen. 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 Right. You right. stopped showing up. Amen. Right. That's right. So I'm asking you this morning, don't get in a hurry. Be honest with yourself. Where are you at today? Since you've come to the place that you've known God, what, what have you gotten to? Have you made a little progress and then stopped? Have you made any progress at all? Whatever your answer is, I can assure you of this. You haven't arrived yet. Amen. Amen. I don't care how long or how good or, or, or maybe you're doing everything exactly right that I just got done talking about. You are still not a completely matured individual right. yet. Amen. 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 That will not happen until we step into yeah. the other yes. side. Yes, yes sir. Amen. That's it. Right. That's then it. you'll be complete. Then you'll know. Amen. Amen. Until then, I keep striving. That's right. Keep pushing forward. Keep going. Yes, yes, yes. I keep, yes, keep yes. giving it everything I got. Yes. That's Thank right. you, Lord. Amen. How about That's you? Where are you at? Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. Please, everyone. There, there shouldn't be anybody that says, well, that's, that's not me. Everyone, find you a place to pray, to get before the Lord. Lord, help me to move on from where I am. Yeah. Wherever that is, it don't Wherever matter. It is. Yes, Hallelujah. Yes, yes, yes. Help me to move on from where I am. Lord, I know I need to be more spiritually mature than I am right now. Amen. Amen. Is that a true statement? Yes. Yeah. Amen. 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 Everybody that will please, please come. Get before the Lord. Thank you, Lord. Call out to Thank you, Jesus. Ask him to help you. You will. That's he will. Amen. 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 Fill it completely full. What you want me to do? Take control and fill my soul so that I may see that I can be like you. Here's my heart. Fill it completely, Lord. What you want me to do, take control and fill my soul so that all may see that I can be like you. I want to be
things of our life that we know that we need to put down mm -hmm. whatever those things are maybe they're not things that you can physically throw into the fire you know some are right. saying that they're, you know, they're going to write some things out maybe on the paper and throw it in that's good but here's what that signifies when something gets burnt up it doesn't exist anymore mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you're saying spiritually that that's what you're saying to that thing right. that you're okay. serious about this Right. God, I'm serious enough about this that when I throw that into the fire, whether it's something physical or written down in a piece of paper, it's gone. Yeah. Right. Right. Amen. 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 You need to understand that. So they'll still be going through motions, and I, mm -hmm. I, I don't believe that they are, but I guess I got to be pastor. Sorry. It's all right. Amen. Got to instruct. It's all right. It's good. Be serious yeah. about this, because the worst thing in the world you could do is to make a promise or to proclaim or to make a vow mm -hmm. to 
God and then to go back. Yes. Yep, right. yep. That's true. That's There's true. nothing worse that you can do. Because yeah. if that was a source of trouble before, it will absolutely destroy you now. Yeah. That's right. Right. Amen. Oh, hear me. Amen. Amen. So I'm, I'm encouraging you to do this. Thank you, Lord. To have your heart in the right place. Amen. Amen. That's right. That's right. That you're doing it for God, not because all the other kids are doing it. That's right. That's right. My mom will be proud of me. Or Amen. That's right. Say they will be, but that's not why. That's right. Right. Speak right. the truth. That's right. All right. And Amen. as she said, it's not just for kids. And you know what? Us adults pick up some things along the way, too. Yeah. yeah. yeah that's true. That's true. Sometimes we, we need to clean house, too. Yeah. Amen. Amen. That's right. By example, then our kids will know that's right. what to do. When they see mom and dad being serious, yep. they rub off. That's right. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Friday night. There's I thought I had her. <laughs> Friday night, there's a singing at Wheatfield Pentecostal Church. We're about 49. 49. Um, starts at 6 o'clock. Yeah, six o'clock. They're doing a gospel singing. They're doing that. Um, no, there's no charge. Just come and sing, and then they're serving food after. So they invite us to come be a part of that. And don't forget too that next Sunday, uh, Jeff and April will be with us. So yeah. remember that. Mm -hmm. Raising your hand back there, Ezekiel. Stand up. I can't uh, see you. I can't. <laughs> oh. Revival at a uh, word of faith. When's that? This week, and it's Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Friday, Saturday, Sunday. You can go Friday and Saturday. You're not allowed to go Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> Got to be in your home church on Sunday. Right? Amen. 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 Anything else that I might have missed? Anybody else have any other announcements? Anything coming up? Thank you, Lord. Good looking crowd here today. Amen. Love Thank you, and appreciate you all. Glad that you're here. Amen. Thank Let's Lord. dismiss some prayer this morning. Brother Ken, you want to dismiss us in Thank prayer? Thank you, Lord. Let's pray, church. Praise God. Heavenly Father, we just thank you, God, for your spirit, Lord. Most of all, you let us here, Lord. And thank you, Father. Each and every day in the church house, Lord, we ask God that you just go with us, Lord, and grow our uh, uh, fellowship here, Lord, that you just uh, let that word just be in our hearts and on our minds, Lord, and we use it, Lord, that we be uh, growing in grace and knowledge of the Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. That we walk down uh, your path, Lord, that you set before us, Lord, your priest, uh, in your word, Lord, that we take it to heart and be serious about it. Yes, Bless the service tonight, Lord. Touch the, the young children, Lord. Yes. Touch the young adults, Lord, that they uh, uh, adhere to what's been instructed to them, Lord, that they're serious about serving you, Lord. For this is the next church coming up, Lord. Yes. And we know, Lord, that you want a holy church. Yes. 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 Oh, God, work in their hearts and work in their lives, Lord. We give you praise and glory, Lord. Bring us back the next appointed time. We love you so much. In Jesus' name. Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Am